Yo, what's going on YouTube? What's going on stream? Oh, Alright, let's fucking run this shit, man. Hey, yo, what's fucking going on, man? What's fucking going on, people? I'm gonna stop swearing because I want to get my channel monetized. Why am I swearing at it? <laughs> Let me lock in. <laughs> oh, I feel good, man. I feel locked in, chat. I'm ready for this. I'm ready for this. Oh, good, man. Can't I just had some steak? Hey, Sifu, what's going on, mate? Little birthday Sifu. That's my guy right there. Yo, happy birthday, bro. Fucking birthday, mate. Alright, let's go, man. Come on. Let's fucking run this shit. Oh, yo, yo. Alright. First game one. What we got? We got a nice little real search and destroy. Let's see how this one goes. Alright, let me turn that FOV down. You guys know I've been playing some Warzone. I'm gonna go straight down to 105. Um, and yeah, see what we can do. See what we can do in this game. Oh, this guy's pushing us straight away. Nice little kill. Take him out. Alright, there's gonna be no trophy off the break there. So that stun's gonna go through. That nade's gonna hit him. I'm gonna jump to the right. Right, at least we. Oh shit! No, he's on the right. Thing is, I knew he was gonna be there before, and that's why I jumped across. I should have just um, committed to that, but I should have just committed to that area a little bit earlier. I knew he was gonna push that for sure. All, all good though. All good though. All right, let me try something here. If I can. Oh, I think we're all right. <clears throat> See if you man, we've been up to today, bro. Vigilance with a follow. Let's go, man. Thank you so much for the follow, Vigilance, man. I appreciate that. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hi, I'm new here. Hey, what's going on, my boy? What's going on, bro? How you doing, Vigilance? Chat, first round not going our way. All good though. We move. We move to the second round. Hey, that's three likes already on YouTube, man. You guys are insane. Thank you very much, YouTube. I appreciate that. I got an ad, so I can't hear you. <laughs> all good, all good, all good. Let me know when that ad's done, my boy. No. Yeah, vigilance. I'm not. Let me know when this ad's done, bro, so I can welcome him to the community. Okay. I right, got absolute. Just gonna overpeak it. All right, guys, one shot. Teammate should chase him. There you go, man. Great team right there. Oh, get the trade for me, man. Get the trade for me. No, bro. That's unfortunate. What's going on, Vigilance? Uh, I'm not sure if you heard me earlier. I just welcome you into the community, man. Thank you so much for uh, for dropping a follow, my boy. Appreciate that. One v one. This guy can actually win this shit. This guy can actually win this. Ah, the time's going down, man. He's got to do it now. He's got to do it now. Oh, good. Oh, good. Oh, ah, he wins. Okay, we'll take it. 
Hey, we would take it. All operatives, bomb defused. Swarm that round. Get ready for the next one. We will take that shit. You can name it out. Hey, Vince Vince, all I was saying, my boy, is um, welcome to the community. Thanks so much for dropping a follow, man. I really appreciate it. And uh, yeah, man, just hope you have a good time in the community, my boy. Appreciate that. Do you put an exclamation mark on Discord? You should be able to get a link to our Discord server. Our community server. So if you guys aren't in it already, make sure to check it out. Make sure to jump in. Oh, this is not going to be good. Yeah, 2v3. I just got to hold my line a little bit. <clears throat> That's rough, man. They, they had a good kind of uh, grips on, on that side of the map there. I'm going to try something a little bit different in the next few rounds. Maybe get a sub out. Maybe get a sub out. Three rounds in. Obviously, 0-3. Not the start you want, but it's not the end of the world. I'm already part of the survey. That's fantastic, man. Thank you very much. Hmm. Alright, let's keep going, let's keep going. Just lock in there. Objective. Obviously, we got a lot of the map pressure here. No. I had to get that trade, man. I had to. There's someone actually on the left as well. The problem is we've kind of given up a lot of the map here, so they want they can plant at B. It's not ideal. Okay, this might be opportunity chat. Oh, I need my teammate right there with me, man. He just like I don't know why he's playing so passive. He needs to be with me there getting into the action. Like we're down already in numbers, he should be helping me out a bit. I'm actually going to full send this side here. Like, I just need my teammates to get a little bit more aggressive with me. Kind of uh, just push up with me here. There's already someone up there. 2 so made him weak. Okay, now we push up a bit. I can maybe make a play here. I heard the door open as well. I'm just going to take my time here. Oh, they just die again? Oh, my God. Like, come on. What's going on? Come on, boys. What's going on? Like, why is no one pushing up with me? <laughs> we have so much room there. Chat, so much room there to push up, man. And just really, really make something happen there. <clears throat> All right, back against the wall. This shit ain't over, though. This shit is not, it's not over, though. Right, we got we got to change our approach, man. We just got to get that first blood, make things a little bit easier for ourselves, and go from there. Everyone does die on the team. There's one back there. There's, there's a second. I know one was going to be on the on the kind of back truck. There's two. Perfect. Hmm. 
I mean, he's probably... He, I don't think he could be behind me, surely. Where my team are, I don't know where he is, to be honest. Somehow, oh, there you go. I was like, bro, somehow he gets the bomb down. Like, what? Yeah, where did that even come from? Dylan, what's going on, Dylan, man? Hey, thank you for the followers, well. I appreciate that. Long time no CA. It's been a while, Dylan. How you been, my boy? How you been, bro? That's an OG name right there, Dylan. I, hey, Dylan, I know you've been, I know you've been grinding Rebirth, bro. I know you've been grinding Rebirth. How are you finding that? <laughs> It's been a minute, man. What's going on, bro? What's going on? Our voice is going, man. All right, four two down. Teammates gonna go. We're gonna switch switch the pacing up here. We're actually gonna go towards B. There's one. I just don't want anyone to pinch me here. I'm out of there, bro. I'm out. What's going on, my boy? Where do you want to go, bro? Do you want to go A? Do you want to go B? Where do you want to go, man? You made the play. I'll come with you. All right. We can go there. We'll go together, man. We'll hit the shit together. We're planting a Bravo. No. I actually get the first guy. I think that was a pretty good kill there. Leaving leaving him in a 1v1. Um, I'm okay with it. Obviously, I wish I was in control, but it's all good. I'm good. I'm good now. Honestly, I haven't played too much COD in the last few four months. Oh, okay. Yeah, it happens, man. I feel like, obviously, because I do content now, it's like I play more than... I mean, if I didn't do content, I probably wouldn't play as much, to be honest. It's just one of those things, man. I, and the game, the interest changes, stuff like that, man. Hit every first season. Nice, nice. Standard shit. I like that. Fuck with that. <laughs> Standard. Hit eerie first season and then dip. <laughs> I, I actually enjoy this game though. Probably more than last year. So I think as the maps start to improve as well, I'll probably play this more than last year. Keep the enemy off the objective. Like naturally, I enjoy this game. Um, some maps and stuff on my side is a bit boring, but the overall game I'm actually okay with. So once they add these new maps in, I'm, I'm actually okay. No way. How am I like I need to win that? Let me see. Let me see from his POV here. So he obviously pre me. He read that well, but <clears throat> I don't know, man. Maybe I jump a little bit. I don't know, man. Just gotta win that, man. Just gotta win that one. YouTube, what's going on, man? We got 20 people in the chat. We got 20 people, 20 viewers, but no one in the chat. What's going on, YouTube? Where's the energy at? Where's the energy? Where's the energy at? <laughs> Hmm. All right, let's go. Back against the wall, chat. This is it. This is it. Back against the wall. This is where we're going to make something happen. Oh, shit. That's not the start you want, man. 15 grenades flying at your head. Flying at your boy's head right there. All right, there you go. Baited this guy in. Teammate, just play their life a bit. We need to get this bomb. You've got the bomb. Let's see if he's hit this side. If he's not, I'm planning it. I'm scared it down. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. There you go. I thought he might wrap round simply because he wasn't going through boxes he wasn't going through their side i thought he might wrap around and yeah teammate teammate took care of that man good ship hmm. chat one more round to bring it to the round 11 can this be a five three curse what do you guys think man what do you guys think chat hmm. 
Chat, what do you guys think? 5 3 codes. What's going on, Dharma? How are we doing, my boy? Welcome, welcome, Dharma. Back to the stream. Hope you're doing fantastic. I want to get aggressive off the break here. We're going to full send this chat. Okay. Someone opened this door and it was not me. Alright, chat. You guys know that you guys know the rule. High risk, high reward. Let's see what we can do here. That's okay, we're on the retake. There you go. Good pinch from the team there. We're making one shot, gonna push through. There's gonna be someone in these boxes for sure. There you he's stunned right there, chat. Gonna go around. There's one. Second guy's gonna be on my left there. There you go. Just like that. Another retake. Let's keep going. Let's get some energy in there. All right, we'll take that, man. We'll take that for sure. All right, this guy looks like he's gonna kill me. I don't want to. I don't want to mess with the guy. You, you take the. You take the. You take the bomb defuse, man. It's all you, bro. You probably get more SR from that bomb defuse, but you know what? You take it, bro. You do your thing. As long as we win the game, I'm chilling. Hmm. That was a. Uh, I'm pretty happy with that round, man. I think we we caught them in the trap. As soon as you got the bomb down, as soon as we had numbers, I knew we could uh, we could pinch it, and yeah, played it really well. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. What can we do here? Round 11 seafood chat. Can you get some fucking love to seafood? It's seafood's birthday. Can everyone fucking spam some love? Seafood's the absolute goat, man. Without him, there would be no streams, man. This guy helped me in my early days so much. So please, please show him some love, man. All the Discord stuff, all the grinding, all the stuff. The just, just overall, he's a big help to the to the business and the the content. So please, show him some love, man. Let's lock in for the round 11 chat. Teammates actually going for the pinch. They get one. I'm literally just trying to distract them, and my teammates hopefully can plant an A, sorry, a B, and I'm just trying to keep this guy trapped here. Okay, what, what are we playing at? Are we trying to get A or B? Okay, or none. It's up to you guys, whatever you guys are feeling. Idiot. He actually full sent the boxes. You've secured the device. Bro, like, we're in such a bad spot now. <laughs> this is my teammate's fault. Bro, come on. Chat, we went a 3v4. So 4v3. They just didn't do anything. Oh my god. Bro, I don't know what they were doing there, man. <laughs> oh, chat, that is rough. That is rough. Sifu, YouTube is showing some love in the comments as well, man. So, happy birthday, bro. You got Redneck Punisher. What's up, hey? What's going on, Redneck? How are you doing, my boy? We got Kenneth. Kenneth, yo, you got the combat almost, bro. Almost. Last round, man. Hey, we stretched it out to the last round. You win some, you lose some, man. That was an unfortunate one, but it's all good. I'm here multitasking, so not really typing. Hey, epic. I told you I'll be back, bro. I told you we'll be back for another stream, man. How you been? Sam is swim. What's going on, Sam or Sammy? I'm not sure, but what's going on, my boy? Cap Captain Deadshot, are you playing hybrid? Yes, sir. I am playing hybrid. I'm playing hybrid, but I've actually got a... Um, Envision controller. So on the side of it, I can use the there's a button on the side which allows me to dolphin dive. That's what I use. You're going for real? Birthday blessings G. Hey Coco, man. Thank you for the nice message. You too, Punisher. Appreciate that. Just got some control freaks. Nice. How are you finding them, man? Do you find them more useful for your aim? I've used them years ago. I might should I get a pair of control freaks? I mean, I don't know. I feel like they'll probably be useful. Hmm. Do the bomb sold. I mean, I don't like to blame people, but yeah, I agree. I think he just kind of, uh, he just he just needs to be quicker, man. And then he went to like overcommit. I don't know why. Like we kind of had over him, but you don't want a chance. You don't want to take it to around 11 anyway. So it was always. Don't get control freaks. Why not, Sifu? Why not, mate? Well, it anyways, but. I was playing ranked earlier today and was getting wrecked. The enemy seemed me around corner first and half our shots in register was insane. Yeah, I'm sure there was a lot of cameraing involved. You've got to remember as well, with the new season being out, a lot of the ranks did reset, well, all of the ranks reset. So, for example, anything from Crimson and above 
all have gone back to diamond, right? So you might get into a game where you have four crimsons on your team against four top 250s. Now, that is a bit of a dramatic kind of overview of the situation, but that is what could happen, you know what I mean? So right now, we look at the level. This guy who's plat three, that tells me that he was probably <clears throat> like diamond three, very close to crimson, and he just unfortunately didn't make it, and then he went back to plat. Or he was diamond one, and he lost a few games, and now he's back to plat three. But you can't really tell. And then on their side, you've got a diamond one with a red flame. He looks like he's been grinding. If you get a red flame and you're in diamond one, he's probably either a really good player just trying to get out of this area, or he's... um. Well, yeah, that's probably it, to be honest. He's probably just a really good player trying to get out of diamond one because he got reset. So a lot of different variables. All right, let's lock in, man. We've got an invasion hard point. Let's see what we can do. And yeah, let's see if we can uh, get some gameplay for YouTube. Starting off, we're going to go through the right-hand side here. And I'm just going to look at the minimap. Nothing really crazy here so far. Teammate comes with me. I'm going to try pinching through dark with him. So as soon as I see three down, I know they're going to be spawning back Palace. So there's one. The rest should be coming through the street here. There's two. Once again, go to the right here. Kind of center over. And there you go. So right there's about reading the spawns and just making it work for you. So... Unfortunately, the palace spawns aren't very consistent in this game. So like you saw there, as soon as we get a three-piece, it end up switching. Now, that's a big problem with the spawns on this specific map and why they don't work. So I wanted to actually trap them in palace, just didn't work out there. Go through. I don't want to overcommit and die here because that would be pretty bad for the setup. So I'm going to go through. Try to get away and just try to play this broken area. Try to play a bit of an off angle, let them challenge me. There you go, there's two down. Teammates should be able to get that kill. No way. I, so I messed up the first point. Me messing up there was overcommitting. The second I realized I messed up, I almost kind of camered him and got the kill. Now, one thing we're doing really well is we're getting the kills, but we're just not getting the time on the hill here, which we need to get. And I do actually want to flip the hill here. I would prefer to be spawning broken side where they are, simply because for the next hill, you want to be here. There's one. The rest is spawn behind us, which is fine. There's two. The guy is stunned on the left corner, so we're going to go through, get an angle on him. Take out the third. Reposition and there you go. So as soon as my teammate gets the next wave of kills, we should be in a good spot here. So that's why, in my opinion, you want to be breaking through Broken and not through Palace. Because now they're going to be spawning Palace, hopefully. We should be able to get the new rotation. Hard point relocating. Stand by. There you go. Look, looks perfect. They're spawning Palace. They're out of the game. Perfect. Chuck a nade over to the hill. That guy's weak, so we're just going to push him with a pistol. Hard point relocated. Secure the target area. There's one. I am by myself. I'm quite close to a streak as well. So this is where you have to like play your life well and like, value your life. So I'm trying to do, trying to play a bit of an off angle so that if he comes by my right, at least the hill get contested. Right now, it seems like we're doing a good job though. I hear someone on my right. There's one. Now, if I reloaded efficiently there, I probably could have got the second. Oh, I'm one shot. Same thing. Just gonna play my life a little bit. So, like, they have to be coming from my right logic logically, so. That guy's weak. Go for the chow. There you go. There's a two. I mean, we're doing very well right now. 12 and 2. And it's pretty pretty good lobby, so we're doing pretty good, man. Just keep, keep up. <clears throat> Obviously, I have my streak as well now. This guy stunned me from my... He's probably going to push me, yeah. And that... In that scenario, I have two options. One is to go for the kill, and two is put the controller down. Both can have the same result. When you get stunned like that, you might as well put the controller down because you're not going to get out of that one, which is fine because we, we, we're going to push through. We're not going to get trapped into a palace here. It's going to be one pushing me probably. There you go. So right now, I just baited him in. The second I shot the second guy at the back, I knew this first guy would probably push me. Go through a different angle. There's a guy on my left. Take my time. Oh, good shots from him, man. Great shots from him. Up by 65 seconds. We have the uh, we have a we have a what's it called cruise missile as well. What you don't want to be doing is you do not want to get trapped into palace. So every time I get out, I'm trying to run away. Really good shot there again. I'm just trying to get out right now. I just don't want to get caught in this trap at, at palace. Another one down. That's two. There you go. Oh, almost got him with the melee there, man. Not bad, though. We're actually kind of frying right now. Like 15 and 5, I believe. Yeah, 15 and 5, 3 KD. Although they get a bit of time there, 
We probably could have stopped that, but it's not the end of the world. This guy's probably got up top. Just get away. Let this guy chase me if he needs to. There you go again. We'll take him. We're frying. So right there, what do we do? Well, we'll get into cover. There's one. There's a second. Third guy's behind me. Just let him go. Just leave him. Let him chase me if he needs to. Play through a different angle. Where are they going to spawn? Well, probably Palace, based on the mini-map where my teammates are. The there you go. Let's hold it from this angle. Trophy goes down, because once they spot me here, they're going to try to take me off. There's another one. And you can see we're just, we're just constantly playing ahead. Playing ahead of the game. Taking the game to our opponents. Don't giving them too much opportunities to get back into this. Same thing here. This guy's weak. We challenge him now. I'm one shot. He's going to charm me. Just play my life if I can. Like, he wasn't expecting the reach out there, which is good for me to go through. Go through all the way around. And there you go. We're back on the hill. About taking your opportunities. Trophy system's coming up right there. Same thing. Go through the right. Are they going to expect this? Probably not. So we go behind them. I mean, I don't know what to say to that one, man. That's just a good read on the mini map. Go through, get another one. And we're, uh, yo, we are piecing right now, chat. 15 seconds left. What I want to do is I want to keep them trapped back in uh, Back Palace, okay? So I'm going to make a make a decision here to use my cruise missile. 23 and 5. Could not get much better than this right now. There's this guy. He should be dead. There you go. And just like that, we should... Okay, so the problem we have now is my teammates decided to push Palace. If they had the perfect trap there, we could have actually had them trapped in Palace there. But instead, we're kind of uh, splitting spawns all over the place. Let this guy go behind me. All good. This might be one of our best games um, this season, chat, for sure. <coughs> for sure. 40 seconds left. I wish I kind of had my second cruise there, but unfortunately, I, I didn't use my first one when I got it. Again, bigger picture right now. What's the bigger picture? Giving them the 30 or setting up for the new? For me, it's going to be setting up for the new, guaranteeing the 50, 55 seconds on the new hard point. That's exactly what we're going to do. Look at the minimap. I can't really tell where they're coming from because we're a little bit all over the place. So I'm going to cover both angles. I'm going to cover both sides, make sure I cover everything until I have a bit more kind of an, of an idea where everyone is. I heard that guy. That's why you have COVID sneakers on. This guy was hella loud. Knew exactly where he was going to be. Got me a free kill. There you go, man. New hard point. I'm by myself. Um, they might flank me, so I've got to be very careful. There's one. Just to keep them kind of staying back there for a second. Don't be afraid to get off the hill. As long as you're uh, controlling your life and, and not just overcoming, it's, it's not the end of the world. I don't recommend it all the time, but like right there, you can see. In this scenario, you know, we're playing really well. My teammate's on the hill now. I don't want to also be on the hill with him. So I'm going to push out a little bit. I don't like to be trapped in the hill like multiple people. I feel like we give them too much map control. They might have, have, they have... Yeah, they might have given up at this point. They honestly might have given up at this point. Shoot one more on the left. There you go. Great shots from him, to be fair. Really good shots from him. Let's see how he, how he played that one. So you can see as he jumped around, he, he made sure his centering was kind of uh, where he expected me to be. So fair play. Same thing this guy did to me. Going to cruise. So I use a stun. Go through, get the ne next 10 seconds. There you go, man. Ooh. Good shots, good shots. This game, we can we can end it here, man. 25 seconds. Now, Palace Hill... Palace spawns are not ideal, but you can hold it from this side. You can't hold the hill from this side. It's just you don't want to get into a blender, because what happens is you give them P4 and P5, and it just, it's just not great. So let's go through. Where's he at? There's one. Teammates get the second. Now, knowing there's two people dead, what does that mean? Well, there's only two people off spawn. The other ones are going to be on hill, so watch the spawn. No one's there, so they're going to be on my close left here. There's one. My teammates spawn behind me, so that tells me they're going to be Palace. That guy gets absolutely cooked. The rest are going to be coming through ice cream side. Straight away, I'm going to go through. I have to cut them ice cream, so they jump around the corner. No one's there. Again, keep them trapped here. This guy's, this guy's thriving, man. Fair play to him. He's doing his thing, but 3KD... 
This is a clinical performance right now. 100 point lead. We just want to make sure we don't take the foot off the gas. Right now, with us losing spawns, this is getting a little bit complacent. We need to make sure we, we just bury them in and we get the, get the rest of the timer. That was actually a big stun. So I stunned somebody middle map there. That jewel is absolutely one shot in the, in the hill right there. Same thing, man. We need 14 seconds. We're just we're spawning a little bit far away. We just have to get the kills here. Stay down. I can watch over him. There's two. Oh my god, we are actually frying. At this point, five seconds left. Just gonna hold the hill. They have to push us. And that is gonna be game. Okay. 34 kills in the lobby. Most time in the game. I'm not gonna lie, that was a pretty good performance, man. YouTube, you guys know the drill. Make sure to drop a like, subscribe if you guys are new. This is on our main channel. This will be uploaded on our main channel. If you guys wanna see more content like this every single day, make sure to check out the Arv Live. That will be in the description. And we also recorded this live on Twitch. But that was a pretty good performance. 3KD, you guys know the drill. Drop a like. Catch you guys tomorrow. Peace. That was a clinical performance chat can i can i like get some gas that was a absolute clinical performance right there in my in my humble opinion i think we absolutely fried them yo i think we absolutely fried them what are you guys thinking chat what are you guys thinking that was a fucking banger right there i'm not gonna lie to you boys straight up cooking let's get it hunter let's see what twitch is saying you play single tap? Yeah, yeah, I play single tap, bro. I play single tap. I just bought an Envision controller. What keybinds do you have to the side? Getting a little mixy. Yes, Prodigy. What's going on, Prodigy? Hey, hey, Doritos, I got you, my boy. Let me show you right now, bro. I'll show you right now, bro. You can screenshot it if you would like. That is my, uh, that's what I've got, bro. So I've got my dolphin dive to the left side and the, the ping to the right. So can you see these buttons here, right? This button here. On the controller, I press that button, it's like on the side of it, and it can dolphin dive. And I press this button here and it, it pings someone. So I can dolphin dive and ping without taking my hand off the right stick, basically. Now, if I wanted to, and then the rest is just standard scuff stuff. If I wanted to on these bottom areas here, I could have a key bind where I can put basically um, like the mute button or switch my audio, whatever. I can just do other stuff like that. Just kind of a lot more uh, custom ability and stuff like that. Chat, we need a few more bangers. We need a few more bangers and then we're going to run some uh, run some Warzone. Kids will put in the blender. Hey, they were getting fucking tucked. What's up, coach? What's getting it? What's going on, Hunter? Where's your accent from? I'm from London, bro. I'm from London. You like it or you, you, you're you not you're not a fan of the accent? What gun is that? Uh, what I was using was the MCW, bro. I was using the MCW. Chat, we are four subs away from 80 subscribers of the season. If you guys have a spare Twitch Prime and you guys are not using it anywhere else and you want to support your boy, feel free to drop it through. I'm going to leave the class, uh, I'm going to leave the link in the YouTube description. There you go, chat, it's in the chat. Oh, high rise control. This is my fucking playground. Let's run it, man. Let's get back to back wins. Chat, can I get some kill predictions, please? Can we get some fucking kill predictions? How many kills are we getting for this next game? And then we're going to be moving on to some rebirth later on in the stream. Fuck with it. Hey, thank you, man. Where you from, bro? Let's lock in. I'm having a good stream, man. I'm feeling good, man. I'm feeling vibey. I can't lie to you guys. I had a nap after my last stream if you guys went for my last stream I, I went to lie down for half an hour i said for two hours i woke up i had a steak some steak and some mashed potatoes Whew, i feel good now all right control on high rise let's lock in see how many kills we can get in this one starting off i'm gonna go to the right street here okay interesting no one's broken the glass so that tells me they're all coming through the left or they're not playing there's just two options here Okay, I was completely checked out from that. I didn't know where they were going to be. I should have just... I'm not going to lie. Like, a percentage of me thought, oh, they're not playing. Let me go check the small. I should have just known that they were on the other side of the map there. That was just that was just really stupid of me. I assumed something went wrong and they, they weren't spawned in or something. That was just like... They really caught me off guard there. I'm not going to lie to you. So they actually end up getting the B point from that. Most of it done. Yeah, so that's just not good enough. 
Oh my god, they, they've just completely taken over that round. Completely. We've had one kill, they've had ten. That is insane stuff. I mean, fair play, man. Fair play from them. Doing a really good job right there. Teammate gets a three-piece. I don't think I've shot my gun right now, which is not ideal. First round in. we got to make some noise here. Gotta, got to put some damage down, man. Just going to watch the right-hand street. There's two more middle. I get one. The other guy's very, very weak there in the middle. He pushes out. There's actually three of them pushing that one area. Again, they're just playing really weird, man. I've not seen much, many people play like this. Too. This play style is kind of all over the place, but it seems to be working. It seems to be working for them. I don't think that they'll catch us like this in the next few rounds, but for this first round, yeah, we're, we're hanging on there. We're hanging on with our life there. Got to try and get something going, Chad. Got to try and get a two-piece or three-piece, kind of bail the team out here. You know they're all over our spawn. Oh, his sprint to fire was just a little bit quicker there, man. He was ready a bit quicker than me. Bro, we are getting tucked. If we lose, I, I don't mind losing on lives. I still want to give them th uh, three ticks here on A. Yeah, which they're probably going to get, to be honest. There's one. Yo, I'm peppering shots at them. I've just not done anything right now. How much damage have I done? I've done a thousand damage for one kill. That's insane. Yeah, this round is over. It's all good, though. It's not the end of the way. I'm not really panicking, but... Can I get there in time? I'd rather die my life, like I said. Yo, that was a terrible round. One and nine? Oh, my God, bro. I got pissed on. That didn't feel like a one and nine round, though. You know what I mean, Trey? You know when you're shooting, and that just didn't feel like that. Dead shot and different with a follow on Twitch. Hey, thank you so much. I appreciate the follow, man. Welcome, welcome to Twitch. Thank you so much. Yeah, chat, that didn't feel like one of those rounds where I was getting fried. I just felt like it was all over the place. I just felt all over the place. <laughs> right, we've got to lock in for this next round, man. We've got to lock in for this next round, chat, for sure. None of us was uh, really slaying out right there. We kind of got caught in a blender. Let's see if we can return the favor to them. There's one. There's two. There you go. Starting off a lot better than the first round. That guy's going to be fully stunned. I'm going to chuck a nade over. I'm going to jump across, get that peak as advantage. There you go. And just like that, we're back in it. Bro, watch behind you. They're going to come through blue, man. See the, see the reads right there, chat. That looks hella sus. I already know the comments going to say I'm having walls, but yeah, we move. Right there, we just map awareness. I knew that nobody pushed for a few seconds, so I assumed somebody was going to flank us eventually. Oh, shit. There you go, man. Hey, we're back in the shit for sure. Now, to get the advantage here, I need to pay for the cruise. No, should have backed off, man. Why am I going forward there? Why am I going forward there? Yo, is a new update just chalk Tyrus control? Is defense, like, spawns a lot deeper? I thought the defense spawns were a lot deeper. I don't know if I'm tweaking. There's two. There's two, chat. And we're putting them in the absolute blender, just like they did to us. You try the new vest? Uh, no, I'm not trying the vest out. Which one? Which one's OP? I'll have a look. Where is this guy shooting me from? Where is this guy shooting from? There's two. No! Don't try oh yeah, so I wanna say don't try the new stuff because there's a chance we'll get banned. I'll just wait for it to all be all be fixed out before I before I mess around with it then. That's really strange that they put it in the game and you get banned if you use it. <laughs> oh We're back in it though, man. We were we were like two and nine and we're like ten and thirteen now, so we're back in it. This round was a lot better. We need to win the round. It's not good enough to just um, have a close offense. We need to actually win it. Right, 
guys chuck a nade on the wall, eh? No. AV4, okay. We sh we're actually in a good spot. 50 seconds left still. I think I'm tweaking. Is my headset on the wrong way? I feel like my audio is coming left or right. I feel like this is what Envoy and Draza do. This is weird. I need to check that shit. Yo, chat, I had my audio on the wrong My headset was on the wrong way. My The left was on the right. My right was on the left. And I could I could feel that it was a bit different. I could feel like it was it was hearing things weird. I was I was kind of confused. No way we troll, man. Shit, we give them that round. We had to win that round, chat. We really had to win that round. Now we're back to the Oh no. Oh no. Oh, we had to win that round, man. Shit. Hey, it's all good. Now I can actually hear properly. We're chilling. <laughs> We're vibing, we're vibing. Is this the guy that... Yeah, this is the guy that wanted to be, be my friend. And now he's fucking shitting on us. That's not very nice of him. Hey, man, we got 15 people over on Twitch. We got 25 on YouTube, man. Thank you guys so much, man. I hope you guys are enjoying the stream so far. First game, pretty shit. Second game, we fried. This is the third game. Not having the best of, uh, of high-rise control, but we're going to lock in and see what we can do here. Straight away, it's all about adapting, okay? So I know that they, they like to play after the start last time, so... That was just really, really good centering right there. Just wait for that shit. There you go. That drops. That shit dropped. Where is this guy? Hey, Tabzina with a gifted sub chat. Show some W to Tabzina, man. Let's get it, Tab. I appreciate that, my boy. Okay, legend, man. This guy's been around for a minute. That's the that's the goat Tabzina right there, chat. That's him. He's him. Thanks so much, Tabzina, man. I appreciate that, bro. Alright. That's two down, chat. three down. Last guy's gonna be on the left hand side there. What are we gonna do? We're gonna wait. We're gonna wait out here. No, what is going on, man? I gotta lock in? Yeah, you're right. I do have to fucking lock in, don't I? Yeah, I gotta lock the fuck in, man. We got this shit, though. We got this shit. <clears throat> Try to see them dubs for the boy tabs. I need to see the dubs trap. No way. Okay. But we need to stop them from getting B. The... And they wasted the cruise, yes. Oh, that is perfect. You know what? We'll take that. They wasted the cruise and we didn't let them get B. So you know what? In terms of ticks there. Honestly, this is a round here, chat. If we win this round, we can fucking, uh, we can get, make the comeback here. This game is so weird. Some games you have such good hit detection. Some, I, I, yeah, I mean, I think that's just online games in general. I think it's very hard sometimes for it to be consistent. It just depends on servers and so much that goes into it that I don't even know about, man. So I would agree though. Some games it feels so clean. Some games it's like, it just doesn't feel the same, man. But again, I don't try to read too much into it. Things I can't control. I feel like it's, it's just going to cause some distractions for me. So I just try to like lock in when I can. All right. This guy's on the far right. That stun should be a very, very useful one with a nade. There you go. It should take him out. Make him one shot, which is good enough for me to push him. No. So if that guy didn't shoot me as I crossed over, I would have been okay there. If his teammate didn't shoot me, I would have been okay there. Starting to shoot again. Did you take him out? Perfect. Oh my god, that was an insane shot. 
but I just tried to like get something going. There you go. We're getting A, man. We're getting A. We're getting B as well. This is very, very good, man. For an offense round, this is this is really good. No, someone's on my right. Please get the trade. There you go, man. Team's doing their thing, bro. The team's doing their thing. It's very important for us not to get trapped in right now. This is so good, man. Two go down. When it's stuff like this, right, you want to just play a different angle. Let Be a little bit patient because the opponents are going to catch them running here. Look at this. Because there's two people down, they're going to be sprinting right now for this. Watch over your teammates. Please don't die to him there. That was so unlucky, bro. There was three of them. No. Yo, my teammates had to watch that one alleyway and we were good, man. I mean, I'm not blaming them. They're doing really well, but that was so unfortunate. We watched that one area. We literally win the round right there on ticks as well. All right, there's two down. So I'm going to sneak on by. There's two, chat. We're waiting for the third right now. He's not an A. He's behind me, though. I need to get out of there. And just play a bit of an off angle. Let them come towards me. I just pissed on that guy. No, man. I'm making so many plays there. I bought so much time for the team right there. We just need one, chat. One wave of kills there. Yeah, we're good. One wave of kills. No, they keep getting me, bro. <laughs> they keep getting me. They, they're using cruises out of their asses right now. I don't even know where they're coming from, chat. I don't even know where these cruisers are coming from at this point. One minute remaining. I see what I mean. Where the fuck did that come from? My teammate was behind him. My teammate was right there. Now we're 4v7. Come on. There's one chap. It all starts with one. Oh, we're just giving them too much respect, bro. Alright, we're all good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Just don't die here. Just don't die. We've got 30 seconds to chill. And he dies. 30 seconds left. No, man. Come on. Oof. It's all good, man. It's all good. You win some, you lose some. Bro, we would have had that shit. Chat, I need to go quickly for like a few minutes. Just need to quickly um, quickly do something. I'm going to leave this video on of my own. Give me like, like five, ten minutes, okay, chat? Oh, man, that's rough. I mean, we went negative because of the first round, to be honest with you. But yeah, it's all good. All good. Chat, let me know if you like st like this style of video as well, because um, this is what I'm trying to do more of on the main channel, more like edited videos like this one, okay? So I'll be back in about five ten minutes, chat. And then we'll run it, we'll run it again. In today's video, I'm going to be giving you guys five tips to help you guys rank up no matter what rank you're currently in. Let's get straight into it with tip number one. Five tips to help you guys rank up no matter what rank you're currently in. Let's get straight into it with tip number one. This is going to be your controller and your graphic settings. So, like you can see on the screen right now, these are my current settings. What you want to be doing is making sure you guys utilize the best settings in the game. Now, let me give you a bit of an analogy. I don't think that's English, but we're going to move on anyways. For example, imagine you're playing with football or any sport and imagine you go into the game just not prepared, not kind of having the right equipment, not the right trainers. For me, that's how I kind of look at Call of Duty the same way. If you're going to play rank play, and try to rank up no matter if you're playing casually or competitively i feel like you need to prepare before you get into the game and that's why i do think controller graphic settings are really really important now recently when i've been coaching people they've been telling me that for example they had motion blur on they don't change their sensitivity all this stuff i think is really important now for me the big settings to look at the most important settings are your fov your controller settings and your dead zones okay so i'm gonna start off with your fov if you're playing warzone 120 no problem if you're playing multiplayer if you're playing rank play which most of you probably are i would recommend going between i would say 97 and 105 
I think that's a sweet spot. I used to play a 97. I feel like if you just play multiplayer, maybe more of an assault rifle player at that medium to long range distance, that's perfect. If you're more of a flex player or just generally, I feel like 105 is not a bad range because you get to see the map a bit wider and also feels pretty good. The recoil feels pretty good. I recommend 105 FOV as my final one. Go into controller settings. Again, this one's a bit different in terms of sensitivity, but I would always stick to around 6.6 six and then work from there. Now, there are exceptions in the league. Celium, he plays 10.7, is very kind of unique. I have played that for a while, I do like it, but I honestly have to say your shot does feel a little bit wonky with it. However, you do get the advantages of the movement. So, I think it just depends on your play style. The advantage of having a higher sensitivity isn't to kind of snap onto people it's more the fact that you have the freedom when you're aiming down sight to kind of move left and right and kind of pre-fire and just be a little bit more snappy in general in your gunfights but you don't want to rely on that what you really want to rely on is your centering which we'll get to later on but centering is very important and that's why i think having like a 6-6 six, six sensitivity is perfect for that so those are going to be your kind of main controller settings i do have a video as well which i will put in the description giving you guys a full list if you guys need it now moving on to tip number two this is going to be practicing warming up against bots now again just like with sports or anything else you do if you go straight into the match without getting kind of like a feel for the rhythm and warming up you're going to be at a disadvantage now i know a lot of you guys watching right now you probably don't warm up okay and i'm gonna be honest whatever you do in your games you are basically trolling let, let me explain let's say you play a game of whatever hard point skid row okay let's say it takes 10 minutes and during that time your first game you get 25 kills it's taken you 10 minutes to get 25 kills, okay? What happens is your actual hands and you warming up during those 10 minutes, if you spent that 10 minute time against bots, you probably could have shot 200 bots, maybe 150, okay? Now that for me is a lot better like value for your time. If you're really trying to improve, you're really trying to step up your level, I highly recommend shooting bots, making sure you practice your mechanics, okay? Let's go through shooting bots, kind of, um, I showed you guys how to set up just now, but let's just go through the actual game and what you wanna be doing, what you wanna be focusing on. So what I like to do is I like to double down on my weaknesses. So let's just say I'm really struggling with the long jump. What I'll do is I'll go into bots. All right, right, for the next 50 kills, I'm specifically going to jump around the corner and use the long jump, okay? Don't just shoot bots. Train your weaknesses. Let's say, look, I really, really struggle with a jump shot. I just can't get it right for whatever reason. Okay, let's go into bots, use a jump shot. What you're going to see is, oh, okay, my, my centering's a little bit high. Oh, my centering's a little bit low. You're going to start to correct your own gameplay. And for me, that is very important and probably the best way to improve as a player. I feel like if you want to improve as a player, you don't really need to work on your peak. What you need to do is you need to work on your floor, okay? Now, let me explain the difference. The so peak is your best performance. If everyone has their best performance at all times, obviously, they're going to be a great player, right? But what you want to do is you want to work on your floor. An example is Atlanta Phase. If you look at the team of Atlanta Phase, their floor as a team is top three. That means every event they're going in, they're probably going to hit top three. Now, for me, that is why they're the best team in the world for the last maybe four years is because of how high their floor is. You as a player, okay? If you look at someone like Celia, his floor is insane he never really has a bad performance now what happens is your floor if you can gradually increase your floor then your ceiling will also increase okay hope that makes sense so what you want to be doing is going into bots training certain mechanics training your centering your movement just training certain mechanics making sure you're ready for the gunfights which takes us nicely into tip number three so tip number three is going to be mini map awareness how you guys can use the mini map to your advantage let's take a look right now so in this first clip you can see we're on hard point right and if we look at the mini map my teammates are watching the left so the first thing i want to do again i am playing solo queue is i'm going to look at the mini map and just see right what area is empty so right now if all three of my teammates are facing this left street that straight away gives me an insight that the right side is open to a flank so i'm going to go through i'm going to sit behind this tank sit behind cover and watch the right side so now i'm going to use my equipment so as my stun is going through into kind of the back of the mannequins i'm going to go through now i'm going to watch into cd we go through we take out one straight away we turn to the side again and you can just see how i'm trying to look at the map and pick up some um some empty positions we go through watch the far flank same thing so even if right now i don't get any more kills you can see just from that play alone i'm able to kind of watch the flank and we should be able to get the rest of the time going into clip number two it's going to be sub base again similar scenario so if we take a look at our setup right now we have two people in the bottom tunnel we have one person on top so both sides are open the right hand side and the left hand side now i just had a look at the right hand side about a second ago and nothing was there so straight away my only attention is going to be the left hand side so we go through you see there's actually an opponent coming from the top so straight away we're going to go through we're going 
going to center onto him. The second we take him out, I now think about the timing and say, realistically, if somebody was going to push the left, this would be the time to do it. So straight away, I'm going to go through. I'm going to slide across. You can actually see, I actually kind of messed up my slide cancel here, but luckily my centering was really well. So we go through, we're able to take him out. Now in this position, as soon as I get this kill, I'm going to push through and try to flip the spawns. Again, another example of just basically looking at the mini map. On the same map here, we kind of go forward to the next P5. On this actual hill, right, you want to think, right, where are the opponents coming from? from and where do you want them to be so p5 going into p1 you want to keep the opponents trapped on their side of tunnel so right now i'm going to go through we spot the first guy the second i take him out we're going to back off here and i'm actually going to reposition the second i look at the mini map what can i see well there's one enemy under tunnel so i know i have the advantage here so straight away i'm going to go through reposition take him out and once again reposition again and this is the exact same moment here but kind of later on in the game i think this is the same game it might be a little bit different but regardless it's the same map on sub base and now I actually have a submachine gun so we're going to go through and i want you to just have a look at the mini map right here so this actually uh, was able to get me the two piece so as soon as we take out one i'm going to jump up top here now based on where they were spawning i knew right now there's an opponent right there okay so if we look at p2 window there's an opponent right there so the second i jump up here i want you to look at my crosshair as i jump up my crosshair goes towards it so as he flies out i'm able to center on and take him out now when people see this clip without looking at the context it looks very where it looks like i knew exactly where he was and that's why looking at your minimap can help you guys so much right now again minimap where is he he's in the window so we're going to go through we know he's in the p2 window so we take out the first player we jump up top as he approaches the window we're able to take him out and progress across the map so really good map when it's there it takes us into our last clip here so again we're going to go through now we have a nice little pinch going okay so as this hill's finished i want to actually get away from palace and break this kind of cafe area so we're going to go through i know somebody's on the old hill why because if we go back a second if we look at the mini map there's somebody on the hill right so i'm going to be playing for that guy but what, what i want you to notice again is the mini map so this is what you always should be looking out for the second i approach this player here i can see somebody is fighting on my left and from first glance it looks like he's mid tank so i'm actually going to jump across so as i go across now my crosshair is going to center to the left exactly where he's going to be and i'm able to actually get a nice kill on the other player that wasn't even him so again if we go through you see i get the first kill I see this guy's on the tank here, gonna go through, slide across, and we're able to take him out. So using the minimap can give you so many more advantages. Let's move on to tip number four. So we just spoke about the minimap and how you can use it to your advantage. Now we're gonna kind of take it up a step. We're gonna talk about the minimap, but also about the kill feed and how you can combine them together to increase your map knowledge and awareness. So starting off on this clip, we're gonna go through a similar scenario to the last one where we're kind of sitting on the P3 invasion. And if we look at the setup right now, it looks pretty good. Straight away, we're gonna go through, my teammate gets taken out. So the first thing I'm going to do is I spot this kill feed I spot the opponent's death sorry my teammate's death right here and my first thing I'm going to do when I see this whole thing is look at the mini map and see right where is that player so it looks like he killed my teammate from just in front of the kind of this DVD area here so straight away I'm going to go through and I'm just going to watch the front and there you go we end up taking out the first player now again looking at the kill feed i can see it's a one for one trade so the reason why looking at the kill feed is so impactful is because what happens is it allows you to kind of identify the map pressure so as we go through now i, don't, I know there's a teammate on my left so i'm going to go through i'm going to go through and i can see that two people are actually shooting him right now so as he backs off i'm kind of going to assume he's weak here now i think that's a fair assumption there's two people shooting him he's probably going to be weak so what's most likely going to happen is one of them are probably going to push him so straight away we're going to go through i'm going to slide across and you can see i'm actually going to basically trade my teammate we go through we get one and just like that we're basically going to use a kill feed and use a mini map just to get information and overall just kind of bait and switch here so you see we go through we take out the second guy and we're able to get the rest of the scrap time now i'm not gonna lie i thought the clip was a little bit longer it looks like that's it let's move on to sub base here so in this next clip it's the same thing this one's actually really important i think the way i play this was really well so because i'm the furthest pushed out right again looking at the mini map i want you to think right logically if my team's spawning on my left here if my team's spawning kind of back p2 on this p5 where are the opponents going to be spawning now in my head it makes sense for them to be spawning on the right hand side kind of uh, underneath the tunnel or back p3 so straight away i'm thinking okay again if i'm them and i'm pushing the hill what are they going to look at they're probably going to look at this corner i am because it's kind of an obvious corner so straight away i'm going to go through a different position and this for me was really effective my teammate takes out one again we're looking at the minimap pair so the second i get this kill what do i see well my teammate takes out one and i take out one again looking at the names here what can we see well we can see someone here called uh, moriga he ends up taking out my teammate jake so straight away i know that 
the player Jake has killed is not the same player. So that gives me the information that this player here is this Moriga here. So I'm going to assume that there's only one more player there. So straight away, look at this. We go through, we end up taking that player out well, with the help of my teammates. So now I know that that's that Moriga person. What I now know is that three people have died in the last 10 seconds from their team. So if anything, there's only going to be one more person pushing out. So that just gives you a bit more intel. Now we're going to go through. I know that this player is pushed out. He's probably by himself because the rest of his team are going to be further back, okay? So if we back off slightly and play in fast motion, we can kind of dissect the together so we go through first kill goes to my teammate second goes by me the third's on my right so we're going to go through we're going to uh, be able to take him out with help of my team now we're going to go through the last guy is actually already there again because of the kill feed i'm able to identify that he's by himself so we're going to go through try to distract him and once again he's going to push by himself we go through and now there's two of them my teammate takes out one i take out the second and that is going to be us winning the game so again using the kill feed using the mini map just working together to get that information really important stuff here now as we go into the next hill exactly the same thing i'm by myself there so right now this is this is kind of tricky because no one's with me so i probably shouldn't be on this hill by myself but we're going to go through let's see what happens take out the first player really good stuff now i actually have to reload so we're going to go to the left here again i'm looking at the mini map what I can see is my teammates aren't quite here yet. So I have two options. One is to kind of run away and play my life. And the second is just to buy time and basically put the pressure on the opponent. So I'm going to do a bit of both here. My main thing is I'm trying to buy time for my teammates. So we're going to go through. I'm going to wait. I'm going to keep waiting. The second I kind of look to the left and I notice that nobody on my team has got a kill. Let me back off here. Sorry. Yeah. So right now, as soon as I get the first kill, okay, what I'm looking at, what are we thinking about the video, man? So you guys, you guys like that style of video? What are we thinking? Dub, L, dub, dub, L. What do you think, chat? Like it? Hey, what's going on, Gamer Lizard? What's going on, bro? How are we doing, Lizard? Just a little bit too long. Yeah, I can see that. I guess for me, it's like, if I'm going to do less quantity, I want to make it like as detailed as possible. I mean, I prefer to have the video a little bit longer. If somebody doesn't watch it, it's fine. Like if they don't have the time or don't have the, just don't want to watch it, it's no problem. I'd rather have the option for people to watch it. You know what I mean? But I do see your feedback of it could be, could be a bit too long. I just get carried away sometimes with certain points. <laughs> I like, I like to talk about those points and stuff a lot. Nice. You like it? Hey, thank you, sir. Appreciate that. WW, hey, let's get it. That's why I see some W's in this fucking chat. All right, let's go through. Let's get a few more games in and then we'll uh, play a little bit of rebirth and call it a night there, man. Chat, I asked earlier on as well. I'm going to ask again. We are um, very close to a thousand subs on my third channel, my Arv Live channel. We need to hit a thousand subs on that channel in order to get monetization and just carry on what we're doing on there. So if you guys, um, you guys enjoy the content, man, we're going to be basically uploading on there every single day. So I'd really, really, really appreciate if you guys can drop a subscription on there, man. We're on 868. If you guys could drop a sub on there, I'd really appreciate that, man. Sorry for keeping, sorry to keep on asking. Whew, all right, let's go. Right, man, let's lock it. Let's lock the fucking trap. Skid row hard point. Let's see what we can do in this new game and uh, new season, man. Let's see what we're, what we're working with. Obviously, nothing's really changed too much for this map and mode, but in terms of the, uh, what's it called? I think there might have been a spawn update, potentially. I've seen something on Twitter about skid row spawns being a little bit weird, so potential spawn update. Another one, take him out. I'm gonna go through. No, they baited me in, man. There was two of them there, chat. There's two of them there. We should be good though. My teammates are kind of going through for the spawn tear. 
There's a guy right there in tunnel. We need to pinch him. There's another one. Oh my god, I'm one shot. Bro, can you get me away? I'm actually gonna wait here for a second. There you go. Now we can push in. There you go. Oh, I, so you don't want to be trapped there, right? You don't want to be trapped in the bottom, bottom of the hill there, but at the same time, you, you want to just obviously play your life, so it's a bit of a balance there. You just We don't want to be trapped where we are now in tunnel. Oh, my teammate goes absolutely huge there. That is big help from him. So one more's going to be in garage right now. Yo, this is a mixy ass game right now to start this one off with. 10 seconds left. We'll give them that, man. Let's start rotating there. So, my teammate looks like he's pinching the hill. He's just waiting for some reinforcements. That is a massive kill once again. They're going to go through. Did we stick him? No, we didn't stick him, bro. <laughs> I wanted to jump across. I thought I was going to die there, so I went for the stick. Same thing here, though. They should be pushing through here. Just gonna make sure we kind of get this top area. They might be going to P2, to be honest. They might be going through P2. Might be behind us here. Oh, he is behind us. The timing right there was off again, man. All good, though. Just the timing right there. 24 seconds left, though. I'm straight away gonna go towards New Hill here. And I wanna basically stop them from getting to tunnel. So what I saw there was I knew he was going to be around tunnel. I kind of overcommitted. I should have just shouldered it and then uh, went through our spawn, basically. That would have been probably a better play. Same thing. They're going to be through tunnel here, so I'm going to go through my teammate. We want to be breaking it through apartment side. Ah, all good. Teammate, teammate takes you out. What, what can you do? We still spawn in back apartment, so that, that's actually fine. Oh, he's pinching me? Yo, what's going on? I need my boys to start shooting. Two and five. I need the team to start shooting right now a little bit. There you go. And we're out. Just like that, chat. We're out. So one's going to push through. That was actually a really good play there, because if I went up the stairs, he would have read that, he would have got the kill. So we go through, we at least get one. We basically just delay their push, if anything. As you can see there, they're spawning basically apartment side, based on the minimap. There's one. Watch the edge, watch across. No, my timing just gets, I'm getting so unlucky right now. Let me get an AR out, hopefully it can, it can fix my timing a little bit. So because we're spawning here, they should be spawning P3 side. Again, got a dead slide. It was really, really annoying. Fifteen seconds. I'm actually gonna chalk this one up. To be honest, and just go, go for P1, man. P1, you can definitely get a lot of time on. I'm just going to chalk this one up. No, again, bro. I missed my shots. <clears throat> Apparently, if you use those uh, bugged vests, it's um, the charging get banned. Like, the game's glitched right now, so I'm not going to use them, bro. Not yet. Wait, wait till they, till they fix it, and then if they're viable, well, I'm done to try them out. They should be pushing through here. Oh, 
手车打佢，按啦。No, that's like two and a half. That's right there, bro. No way. Right, new hill. Up by 40. My teammates have the rotation. That's perfect. There's one. There's three. Let's go. Last guy's in the garage. You should be able to take him out. There you go. Nice and simple. They should be spawning behind me, huh? Or tunnel. Yep, they're spawning tunnel right there, chap. They're spawning tunnel. Teammates should be able to get at least one or two here. Huh? I'll break it. Oh, no, they've got a spit spawn. Interesting. Guys on my right. We'll take it. At this point, we just want the trades to go in. Yo, I'm not gonna lie, man. Keogh's struggling a little bit, but it's all good. We're getting there. Getting a big chunk of time on this P2. But why is he overcommitting, chat? Why is he overcommitting there? Just gotta hold that shit. Doesn't have to do anything. Oh my god, this guy was flying at me. This guy was flying at me. Oh, he times out. Of course he times out near the end of the game. He times out when we basically have the win. That's going to be game chat. It's going to be game. We're going to keep watching this side. Two more there. Let's turn around. They should be behind us. Oh my god. I can't lie. Some of these shots right now with the MG Dumpy were actually beaming. I know we got nerfed, but I feel like we're still doing our thing with it. No, the hit fire, bro. I thought the hit fire was there. I thought we had that one. Ten seconds left. Gonna rotate. We need ten seconds for the win, basically. Twelve seconds there. Obviously, they have 3v4, so it should be easier to break. No way I trolled like that. Bro, I thought he was in the, the front window when I stunned him. We're good. Oh, that guy did not want to get fried like that. He did not want that. Yeah, we, can just, we can just win on the rotation chat. We don't need to panic anything there. Anything crazy. No. Oh my god, that would have been insane if I pop over them. Are we spawning out? Okay, can we lock in? Like, what are we doing? I mean, mm. forgot I didn't have dead silence. Tried to assassinate him. Like I said, this game's just over. We just gotta like get this shit done with right now. We have the numbers just stack the hill. There you go. There's one. We should be able to break it right now. There you go, man. No. Oh my god, that guy got fucking world start. There you go, man. We'll take that. Basically a neutral game. It was a bit weird, to be honest, throughout the game. It seemed a little bit all over the place, but we'll take that, man. Nice little victory for that one. Let's see what we end up on. Oh, this guy got tucked, bro. <laughs> that guy got kind of tucked. Let's see how much SR we got as well. Yeah, I got in double negative. So it was even though they their their teammate left at the end, we were still in control for the majority of that match, which is which is obviously good, but I don't know. Skidder is a weird one, man. It plays okay sometimes. It's just, it's just, I, I don't love it. And I used to, in the beginning, I thought it was maybe one of the best ones. And then now I'm kind of like, I, I actually don't mind it out of the rotation. Like invasion and then Skidder. I prefer sub base sometimes, to be honest. There you go, man. 52 SR, man. Let's keep going. Let's keep going.
<clears throat> Please, before ty typing solo queue to top 250, get to Erie at least once. Tempest, Tempest, I'm going to ask you a question, bro. Is everything okay at home? Like, are you good? You come into the stream just to hate, bro. That's that's pretty sad. I ain't gonna lie, bro. If you're gonna hate, at least do it on a big streamer. I've only got like, you know what I mean? Like, what's like what dope are you getting right now? Like, <laughs> yo, that's actually insane. You're not even hating on a big streamer, you're just hating on on me, bro. That is insane. You must I must live in that head rent free, man. Hey, thanks for the engagements, though, man. You can stay in the chat, bro. You do your thing, man. You stay, you stay in there, you carry on hating, you do your thing, man. It's me, Ethan. What's going on, Ethan, man? How you doing, bro? Uh, major three? Uh? Yeah, it's not hating. I mean, it is hating. It is hating. Stating facts, bro. Uh, okay. Yeah, you're, you're pathetic. That's a fact. It's pretty sad. You just, I don't know, bro. I just don't understand it. But hey, if you're, you're clearly enjoying the stream, you're clearly still in the stream watching. So hey, no worries, man. You do your thing, bro. You can stay. <laughs> Seems like I struck a chord. Mm, yeah, no, you didn't really, to be honest, but okay. It's just funny because you messaged 10 minutes ago. The fact that I replied now and you're typing, that shows me that you're actually sitting there watching the stream. It shows me that you, you're just hating to hate, to be honest. <laughs> Me, me replying doesn't mean I'm triggered, bro. I'm just I'm just reading my chat, man. I'm vibing. I'm chilling. <laughs> I'm chilling, bro. I'm vibing. You can carry on watching, man. You can carry on hate. Yo, leave more hate comments. I'm actually I actually don't mind it, bro. Honestly, man. Get the engagements up, bro. <clears throat> Alright, let's lock in. Rio hardpoint and t yo, they need to get in like Vista and departure, bro. I can't lie. The maps are getting stale again, man. Rio is the only good one I actually like. I actually enjoy playing hardpoint on. Let's see what we can do here. Now, I don't love the play of me going round. I just want to try it too much and see the timing. I don't normally do it. Yeah, they're going to read it now. So, considering my teammates still spawn there, I'm okay there. Because my teammates still spawn on this side, I'm actually okay with that. I get a 2 piece just to kind of clear out that hill. Teammates going round. No, we missed a few shots there, man. Missed a few shots there, but 20 seconds left here. We're okay, man. As long as we get the PT rotation, which we looks like we have. Oh, he's pushed up, man. We've got to be very careful, that guy. He's pushed up a bit. <clears throat> okay. Depends where my teammate spawns. We'll know where they're coming from. Doesn't look like anyone's going to be there. There's one. There's a big two right there. Going to watch over there for the third. Same thing. We see some people just kind of jump on the hill here. I don't mind jumping on the hill. Just going to watch this back alley for a second. No. Oh, my teammate naded me. That's insane, bro. My teammate naded me. I wish that he didn't nade me, obviously. <laughs> we would have been in a lot better spot there, but it's all good. Game's really weird right now. No one on my team's really jumping on hill. So in, in solo queue like this, right, what I like to do is I like to analyze the game and more about what I need to change, okay? So right now I can see that my teammates aren't really playing the hill too much. So I'm probably going to have to get in the hill a lot more for this next few hills if we want to win the game here. So that's what I'm going to do. And the only reason I pushed up there was to kind of stop them from pushing through middle. But I did overcommit slightly. It's all good though. We do spawn here. And uh, my teammate, okay, he's on the hill now. So now I can pick up the left. My teammate does die there. So I've got to be very careful with the flank here. Both of them do die. Someone is stunned on the far right. I'm going to pick up the far left. That's a big kill right there because we want to hold this side of the map here. We want to hold this spawn there. There you go. So that's how important spawns are. Although we lost that initial like wave of kills, you can see just from holding the spawns, we're able to get the rest of the time there. I'm actually just chilling here. I'm okay right now. No, he comes through the window, man. He jumps through. Jumps through the window. 15 seconds left, though. My teammates seem to be rotating. And spawns are everything, man. The, the side you're pushing from is everything, bro. 
no matter how many kills you get from the other side, as long as they have spawns, they're going to keep on just flooding and flooding and flooding. Like, every kill is so much more valuable when you have spawns. Because you spawn them all the way out. There's one. Valkyrs, watch over them. Same thing, yeah. Every kill I get is going to spawn them out. So although I get one, I at least get the second guy one shot, right? To a point where he's not going to challenge and just kind of push them back a little bit. That's exactly what you want to do there. That's three down. That's perfect. Now, assuming my teammates are holding that side of the map, I'm going to hold their top middle for a second. Just for those people that might flank. Oh, somebody's actually already here, which is interesting. Yeah, he played that like, really well. He actually kind of snuck through the gap there. I don't know when, but fair play. Good play from him. 20 seconds left. Back to an even game. I'm going to rotate here. Same thing. So someone's going to be there. You keep them trapped in there. You just want to stretch the map out a little bit. I'm, I'm expecting at least one or two people from this side. Someone's behind us. That's insane. I should get him. There you go. I mean, the long jump there is always going to give you that, that momentum and that advantage there. Teammate spawns with me. Another one down. I'm two off a cruise here. I might start playing for it a little bit. That guy's very weak. No, bro. He's just right there. This guy's just not going to die. All right. Teammate gets through. This is very mixy right now. Same thing, though. We go through to the new hill. I'm, I am baiting my teammates right now. I know he's behind me. I really wanted those streaks right there, man. I was baiting the shit out of my team. Down by 30. Second rotation. Yeah, I think overall it's okay. I think we can play the same way. We just got to... There's just a few things I know I can do a little bit differently. Let's start off with this P1. Let's go through. So my teammates going through. I'm going to go with him. There's one. There's a second. Last guy's going to be on the left there. Close left. I didn't actually see him there. Otherwise, I would have uh, played that a little bit differently. Again, man, that short jump just so kind of impactful. The jump right there just to camera them is so, so impactful. Right, we've got to move on, man. We've got to get to that P2, boys. We've got to get to that P2. We're down by 30 right now. I'm going to make some plays, get some kills there. Let's push up. Now that we've got rid of the trophy system, should make it a little bit easier if my teammates have equipment. I'm obviously use mine. No way. Look at the timing, bro. <laughs> I had a Nate. I had a trophy there, man. The Nate just absolutely smoked me, though. Keep giving them too much time on these on these big hills here. I'll take that as a huge kill. Get them off the rotation. There's two. Okay. Can we just jump on the hill, please? Oh, there's a three piece. Can we just get on the hill, please? Why are we overcommitting as well? We don't want to overcommit. There you go. That, that's what I wanted. I wanted like one or two people there, and then the rest like rotating there. all about the rotation once again chat on the new here what can we do here we do have the spawns again which is great it's a big one someone right behind us i don't know where he is exactly there he is on my right there you guys two down man we'll take that again anyone on my far right looks like they're not there no, he's on the stairs, bro. Oh, my God. Enemies inside the perimeter. Point Secure the area. 20 seconds, man. What's the play? What's the play? I think we just got to rotate once again. Which could be a little bit ahead of them. We haven't had, like, a proper setup chat. 
We've not had like a proper like 30, 40 second set. I've always had one or two in the rotation. Yeah, there you go, man. Good pinch from them. Great pinch from him. Right behind two of us, we should be spawning out now. Alright, we managed to break that. There's one. There's two. There you go. Jump on the hill, please. Watch behind us. Just watch behind us, teammate. We've got this. I mean, that guy should have killed me. I'll watch boxes for a second. Watch boxes. Just watch over. Boxes kind of the only thing empty right now. No, look at that timing. The second I get boxes up, bro. The second I get boxes up, they go through. But again, we're back in the game, man. We're back in the game, man. Okay, it's like literally absolute trap. So there's actually two of them here still. So I'm going to leave them there. So there's two of them in the old hill. That tells me that everyone else is going to be spawning up their side. There you go. No, I didn't mean to do that, bro. I shouldn't have gone up there with, a, with an AR. That's a bad play. Now I've left my teammates by themselves. That's such a bad play for me. With an AR, I don't want to be top middle. I should be supporting them from this side here, like watching over them. There you go. That's what I should be doing as an AR, like watching over them here. There you go. Big, big kill right there. One more on top. Watch over them, probably rotate in a second. There you go, man. Start rotating, man. We can win this shit. We can win this shit for real. Let's rotate. So, we got my teammate on this side. We, we actually want to keep. Oh. We want to keep this side of the map here where I am, just for the new spawns for P2 as well. There's one trap. There you go. Start with one. Oh my god, that's insane right there. He's one shot. Another one down. Let's go, man. One of five right now. Same thing. Gonna watch over the angles. He's on the right. Just using the minimap right there, we're able to see who's on the right and get a nice little pre-fire. That does get us on cruise missile as well, man. Let's keep going, let's keep going. No, he's one shot, bro. He's one shot. We have the spawns. My teammate has the, uh, has the scrap time. We have the rotation. I have a streak. We're not in a bad spot at all. You know they're rotating over, but I just got to make sure no one pinches this side here, chat. There's two. There you go. Now we're in a very good spot. I want somebody pushed out a little bit, but I can be that player. No problem. They're all going to pinch us, man. I can't lie to you. They're going to pinch us. I'm just going to watch the front just in case. There's two. There's three, okay. Starting to cook now. There's another one. There you go. Another one down. There's one more. Watch the left window here. Jump up. There you go. Watch another one. It's front. But we just started to fry that last two hills. And we just went on an absolute streak there. I do have an actual score streak as well if needed there. We spawn at the back. This is perfect, chat. They're going to be spawning at the top here. Watch over. They're going to have to rush in. Hey, that is the ending you want. Let's go, man. 43 to 22 at the end i think we went on like an eight streak i'm not gonna lie to you guys we dropped the most kills in the lobby that was a very very top heavy game that was very difficult i'm not gonna lie to you guys we had to really really kind of take that one out of the bag but
hope you guys did enjoy that gameplay if you guys did make sure to drop a like subscribe to the channel and uh yeah man that's not a bad game at all 43 to 22 we'll absolutely take that one chat we'll take it that was a uh that was a battle chat <laughs> that was a battle i ain't gonna lie to you boys how'd you guys think i did <laughs> How do we do? So that was insane. That was insane. All right, I'm back in a second. I'm just going to get a quick drink and we'll, we'll run it back. All right, chat? Control. The enemy will come for the objective. Don't hold them. Alright, go back. Invasion control. Let's see how this one goes. Starting off, my teammates get a two piece over at the A side. Oh. Oh, okay. So last guy's at B, and then this third guy's at middle. So we need to take them out. Oh, let me turn the music off. My apologies. Alright, we're locked in. Let's let's start again. See what we're doing here. So they're actually all over the B point. They're probably going to capture that. Yeah, it looks like they've got a few people on that. They've got that. They've got that shit under, under lock right now. Oh, how did I not even kill him right there? How did I not even kill him right there? There's one. Let's keep going, let's keep going, chat. So my teammate's going through the top right there. Just gonna watch the street for a second. So that guy's gonna stun him, right? That stun should be able to hit him. There you go, there's a nade. And that's how you use equipment effectively, chat. We back off right there. I really thought I was gonna kill him. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I really thought I was gonna kill him. So let's just pretend I didn't. Uh, let's pretend I didn't, sorry. Mark the target. I mean, there's nothing really crazy going on. It's just a standard invasion control, just nothing happening. <laughs> it's about these next wave of kills though, chat. Big kill right there. Huge kill with a pistol, just open up the map a little bit. So one's gonna sneak through middle, so I'm gonna try to catch him off guard. I don't think that was him from the from the skinny ad. Could be, but I don't think that was. Was that him? Hmm. Same thing there, man. I just used a mini map, saw two of them in front of me, and yeah, I was able to go through. Another one down. Oh my god, that would have been insane. 
That would have been insane if I got that last kill shot. 50 seconds remain. We have the cruise, which is so massive, bro. Like, it's so huge for the next round. And we didn't give them any ticks so far, man. As long as we keep them off the hill here, that's a very good defense. Because what you want to do, challenge your defense, is obviously a perfect defense is giving them nothing, but a realistic one, they're going to get three ticks on B. Just don't give them any on A. If you can get away with giving them no ticks on A, you're actually in a good spot. There you go. We will absolutely take that. Overall kills, I got six kills and I got a score streak. That just means I just didn't do anything else for the rest of the, my deaths, which is fine. Uh, but yeah, we'll definitely take that, man. A cruise missile on this map, it's not the best in the world, but it can definitely do something. It can definitely keep them off the point. It can just definitely do something, man. You know you can see th through those shits at B? Yeah, I, I did think that. I, I know you can see through that at B. Sometimes I just... um. Uh, I don't know. I don't know why I didn't use it. But yeah, no, nah, thanks for that. And uh, you're right, though. You definitely can't see through that. Trophy goes down. Let's see what we can work with there. You know what? We're going straight for it, chat. Just going to hold this angle here. I get one tick, which is so huge. No, I almost solo capped like a two there, right there. Two capture right there. But I just want to talk about that for a second, okay? The importance of just distraction right there. Me going to A, getting two people, like getting one kill and two more people there. That tells my team, right, there's three people out of the picture. They only need to look for one person at B and we should be good to go. I probably could have just captured the point there and helped them out, but yeah, I got a bit over aggressive. Ooh. Okay, so this guy's actually in our spawn. Yeah, there you go. He tried that late pinch right there. Would actually have worked if his teammates stayed alive, but go through. There you go. Perfect stuff there. We get the three uh, the three ticks. So this is the exact same as them now, chat. This is the exact same as them, so we need to get one tick here to get the advantage. Where'd this guy come from, bro? Tove season with a follow, man. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate the follow, man. Welcome to the Twitch community, my boy. Thank you. No, what is going on? We're in the spawn trap blender right now. We're in the absolute blender right now. We need to get out of this shit. Can't let like, satisfying spawn trapping people, but when you're getting spawn trapped, you're just like it's mapping dog shit. When you're doing it, you f you feel kind of like final. <laughs> you're like, yo, I'm actually kind of nice at this. I'm actually kind of nasty. When you're getting spawn trapped, you're like, yeah, this shit takes no skill. We're not really getting any break here, any, any opportunity to do anything. We need to start with the first kill, man. We just need to, you know, stay, stay out for a little bit, chat. Let me lock in, let me lock in. Get this first kill, man. Let's push up the map a bit. One's right there, mid tank. There's one. Told you guys to start with one, chat. There's one. There's a second. Third's right in front of me. There's two of them literally on... On my side of the map there. Hopefully my teammates can, can kind of pinch there. Hey, right, I'll catch you later, man. Thank you, Ethan, bro. You should be tuning in, man. Yeah, I'm aware that for, for you guys in America, obviously the timing is uh, a little bit different to where I am. Ooh. Okay. Uh, the good thing is, chat, we got that extra tick, okay? So the positive is we did get that extra tick at the start of the round that I managed to get A. Besides that, man, pretty standard round, nothing crazy. Honestly, nothing else to speak about, man. Invasion control is very, very stale. And yeah, literally nothing else to speak about besides that round, uh, besides that eight point. It's Ray, what are you doing? One kill? He's on one? No way, bro. We're, we're like, what? <laughs> this guy's on one? <laughs> How are we not, like, frying these guys? 
One and two is insane. All right. <clears throat> right it's all about the break here, chat. Let's have a good break here. I mean, that's a good break. That's a nice little two right there. There's a three. Okay, they should be spawning ice cream here. Alright, they're going to be on my right. I'm actually going to pinch them in here. No, I didn't need to do that. I didn't need to get aggressive there. Right there, you got to take your timing. Make your timings worth it. Not take your time. you got to make sure your timings are working. So, if you're going to push through like the pinch... You gotta make sure they're all facing the front. You know what I mean, chat? They gotta all be facing like where I am now. Then you make a turn to pinch. This guy's behind me. What are you doing there, Arm? <laughs> How do you even get there? I think it's gonna be pretty same thing. Uh, pretty standard, man. They're gonna have. They're gonna get the B point. We're not gonna be able to stop them. And then uh, it's gonna be a fight for the A point. Oh, I managed to to get a nice shot off. He kind of. Overcommitted that angle. There you go. Oh, we can't give them A though. We cannot give them A chat. They're getting that first tick on A. This is what I wanted to avoid. No way. They got the A tick, man. They've even the game up. That A tick right there, they've even the game up. They get the second, they'll have the advantage. And you stop them. Oh, they got it, man. No way. Chat, they actually won that round. Like, they actually got A right there. That is insane, man. I don't know what happened there. The I overcommitted towards B, man. I shouldn't have done that. I should have just carried on playing A. Kind of giving them B. It's all good, though. It's all good. Just a bit annoying. Like, right now, we, we gave them so much time at A. They've now got two ticks, so... They actually have the advantage already. They're on actually they're on four ticks right now. We were on four as well. So as long as we keep at this, which is gonna be very hard to do. They're probably gonna get the B tick here. Huh? Yeah, chat. No way we trolled, man. We give them an extra tick right there. They are one tick up now. Um and yeah, we've got to be very careful. Actually, no, wait. They haven't secured that second part of A. So it's even, chat. It's actually even. Okay. That does change everything. That does change everything. Now it's even. Have they got it? Am I trolling? Oh, they do have it. Okay. I'm fading. They do have it. I thought they didn't have it. The guy that just died should be spawning up. There you go. His teammates should already be pushing through there. for that same spawner again. No. What's going on, Jace? How you doing, bro? How you doing, Jace? All right, so we win the round right there, but again, we just gave them an extra tick for no reason, and that's really going to cost us. Going to this final round, that's, that's potentially going to cost us, chat. We have to have a very, very good offense here, chat. We need to get, we need to get like five ticks, basically. If we want that defense in round 11, which we do, which we do. If I change my quality settings to AM, oh, thank you for the advice, man. Um, to be honest, I'm on uh, basically maximum FPS for my monitor anyways like i'm around the 250 mark so i think i'm okay to be honest bro like, i don't think i need much more fps for the for the monitor it's basically capped at that anyways so thank you though man what this is the guy on four kills what he just fucking turned his hacks on or some shit what was that that's insane Okay. Teammates basically get two ticks at HR. That's insane. That's perfect. That is perfect. I didn't even realize my teammates went rogue at A. That's perfect. And I've still got that cruise as well, man. Let's just get into that round five. If anything, I can use my cruise now to kind of guarantee that round, that defense. Let's 
Let's just pinch them, headshot. There you go, there's a B. Okay. We're actually on five ticks already. That is... I don't know what my team did. They went rogue there. How the hell did they get that? How the hell did my team get those ticks right there? That's insane. Where is this guy? Has he got inside there? So we're looking for like maybe two of them pushed out potentially. I just don't know where they are, chat. I don't know if they're in our spawn or I have no idea right now. Bro, the, the map control is all over the place right now. <sighs> Waste a <of> cruise. <laughs> he wasted a cruise. Ooh. Well, that was two bursts to the chest, but we move. We move on. Be advised, you're low on reinforcements. Should I just invest a cruise here and go for it? I mean, if it goes down to kills, we basically get the defense anyways, to be honest. So I'm going to wait then. I'm going to hold it. Because the ticks are the same right now, I believe. That's a big two. No, he's just there. This, I mean, this map is so awful, bro. <laughs> They're everywhere. Like, I don't even know where they are at this point. They're just all over our spawn. It's just weird. Left. Map is fucking gigantic for a 4v4. Like, 4v4 control on this map is like, what the hell is going on, bro? Like, although Hardpoint's not great because of the spawns, Hardpoint's okay because you know where people are roughly because it's, you know... The hard point, they have to be on that side of the map. With control, they could be anywhere. Like, like right now, we're just guessing where people are. All right, all good. I, th I think we should, based on kills and the ticks, we should have um, we should have defense there. Because I think the ticks were even, and we have a lot more kills than them. So we should be good there. To be fair to them, they're basically playing 3v4. <laughs> And uh, yeah, we should be. Should be switch sides right there. There you go. I, I thought so. Yes. Okay. Control. There you go, chat. We'll take that. We'll take that for sure. Now I can obviously, you know, use my cruise missile. Worry more about just winning the round here than, than the ticks. And yeah, normally the round five defense, it should be a lot easier. Because they have to actually have to go for the win here. If they get a good break, this could be scary still. There you go. They get they get the break. That always happens. I feel like whenever you're playing... Uh... Nah, they got an insane break right there. I'm about to streak this for sure. If we don't break this point at eight, I'm going to streak it. Oh my god, what a kill right there. I'm not going to lie, that was a huge kill. They can have B, man. They can, you can do your thing at B. You do what you need to do. Just let me spawn trap them now, man. Like, they're getting so much map control. I can hear someone. Bro, I heard that guy. I was like, where the fuck is he? Okay, down by four lives. No problem. Biggest thing is just make sure we have map control. What? He's behind me? Okay. This is such a bad round. He kills me, but my crew takes out one. Bro, they're going to win the game here, man. I fucking can't be asked to evasion control. <laughs> they're going to actually win the game here. I need to stop the reinforcement chat. They keep pushing up for free. We're just giving them so much map control right now. We need to lock in, man. What's going on?
what are we giving these guys like? There's one. Alright, should we be behind two here? See what I mean? They're just everywhere. What is going on? 14 to 19. We have a little bit of life here, but we just we gotta be pushing up the map for sure, man. We cannot give them this much map for Georgia. To be fair to them, they're getting cruising out their asses right now. I don't know where these missiles are coming from, chat. It's not looking pretty for us though. Okay. Just gonna hibernate in this corner with him. There's one. There's two. Okay. Second we get two down, we can push up. I get some map control here. There's three. Okay, we'll take that shit. Come through ice cream. No problem. I'll nade over. That guy's one shot. Please don't let him just run in. Okay, he runs in for free. That's fine. No worries. I, I wanted him in our base. That's absolutely fine. 20 seconds left here. This should be it. Gonna have to push in here. Okay. That was stressful. I mean, I don't know how. I don't know how we go negative, bro. That doesn't even make sense to me. I feel like I was actually shooting, but somehow we go negative. That was a weird ass game, bro. <laughs> that was a weird ass game. Alright, chat, we're gonna end it with some resurgence. We're gonna end the stream with some resurgence. And go from there, man. Got a lot of uh, video editing I need to do after this stream. So we're going to do some resurgence and then we're going to end it there. Hey, nice little flame as well, man. We're making our way over. I believe we got Diamond 2 now. Very, very close to Diamond 2, chat. Very close to Diamond 2. So we played about one day solo queue. We're about halfway to, to, to Diamond 2. A little bit slower than I than I would like, but not not too bad. It's okay. It's okay. Resurgence, give me that shit, man. You guys enjoy the stream, man? What's going on, YouTube, man? There's a lot of, lot of members in the chat. My apologies for not keeping up. Let me see what you guys are saying. <sighs> How big of a difference do you think it makes to play 120 FPS to 60? I think it makes a difference, man. I think 60 FPS is kind of low, man. I think 120 is not bad. Like You're actually at a good point at 120. I play on 60 FPS on a TV, getting a monitor after vacation, Xbox Series X. If you play Series X, then you should be uh, be able to get 120 FPS though, right? I feel like 120 FPS is actually good. Jazz Cat, yo of what's good? Love your content. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate you, Jazz Cat. Welcome, welcome, my boy. Anyone here, Plat or Gold, trying to get some games? Yo, Fluid, man. Join the Discord, bro. There's people in there trying to get games all the time, my boy. I got to gold one last season, starting in bronze at the moment. Won't be playing much until the weekend. Nice, Kenneth. Oh, hundred and ten dollars for money. That's that's really good, bro. That's a really good price. I would I would grab that if you can. <clears throat> All right, I've got to head off to work, and I'll stay in here so you can get more watch time. Though, <laughs> hey, thank you so much, Ethan. I appreciate that, man. You're an absolute goat. Thank you so much, bro. Just shit my pants, John. What's going on, man? What happened to your pants, bro? <laughs> <laughs> Are we gonna ignore that? Are we gonna ignore that bit? <laughs> Tenox with a follow. What's going on, Tenox? What's up, my boy? What's going on, Tenox? Go. Ah, let's run it, man. Let's run it, chat. He's pissing it down, chat. It's fucking raining right now. Uh, okay. All right, man. Let's lock in. Let's lock in. Can I get? Can I get a kill prediction, please? Can I get a fucking kill prediction? What are we going to get on our first game of Resurgence Rebirth back on stream? We played a little bit earlier. Chinese, I need a kill prediction, please. All right, today's video, we're playing some solos on Resurgence. Going to try and drop a high kill game, show you guys how I play as a Crimson player in Modern Warfare 3. Rank play, how I can drop into Resurgence, and basically the difference, man. You're going to see a lot of uh, 
different pacing, a lot of different things that I do that I don't normally do in multiplayer. So, starting off the first guy. Take him out. There's actually a guy on my right. I see him sniping. So, we take his armor off straight away. We're going to go for the aggressive play here. Someone behind me, and we're out. Straight away, we're out. Uh, which controller do I use? I use the uh, PC Envision Scuff. Uh, the new Envision Scuff. That's what I've been using. I've been rocking with for the last month or so. It's pretty good, man. Pretty good. Fairly reasonably priced as well. Compared to the scuff, I feel like this is like one of the cheapest ones. So yeah, it's pretty good map. I recommend it. Right, let's go through. I've not actually been in this building in the new map since Freebirds been out again. They've definitely changed this building a bit. It looks a lot more futuristic. Oh, this shitty occupation scan is still here. I see that. I see that made the cut. Yo, I'm having a lot of fun with Rebirth though. I played a little bit earlier. It's just, it's bringing back a lot of vibes, man. I wasn't sure if it was going to feel like this, but it feels really good. Right. Oh my god, he's just behind me. So I went for the reach out straight away there. It almost worked out. I mean, he was just literally on the floor because of that. Um, to be fair, because of that, wherever that thing was, he, he just sat on the floor and it, worked, it actually went out really well for him. I just ran right into him. Right, first guy here. Oh shit. I need to get out of there, bro. Okay, I'm playing at a very fast pace right now. I need to, I need to lock in. To lock it, get me some weapons. Go again. Oh, rival? Okay, you guys know this is my gun right here. We're not losing, we're not losing the gunfight with the rival chat. I can guarantee it. We're not using a one-on-one -on -one gunfight with his gun right now. Okay, three people in the other building. I'm actually going to push through. So it looks like they're top floor. They're still top floor here, so just got to be very careful. There's one. Where's the second? That's not my immediate worry. Now there's that. All right, try. This should be an easy kill. That guy was turned. I'm not going to lie. He was moving, bro. He was moving. We'll go through. Right, what's what's the play here? Yeah. Don't know what that does. We're about to find out. My claim or did I hit someone? I'm so confused with my claim or just hit someone. Okay, interesting. Let's keep keep this rival, this rival with one attachment for now. I have 18 plates. That is an insane amount of plates. I hear someone behind me there. I'm out. I'm out. Chat. I'm out of there. Okay. So I told you guys. I'm not. I'm not losing the gunfire. Right. There, there's a perfect example. Like I got the first shot right there. We go through. We finesse him. I'm very sorry for that. That was that was a bit uncalled for. Oh, shit. No, his loady fucking disappeared. Bro, his loady disappeared. I was gonna use that shit for cover. Look at this. I was out, bro. I was out. No, that's that's embarrassing, bro. That's like you fucking clothes. In. I felt like my clothes fell off or some shit, like, bro. I, I thought I had cover. I shit just disappeared. Oh, that's so so annoying. All right, so we got 20 seconds. We got to play our life for. Alright, we'll tear that. What are we on? Eight? Not bad, not bad at all. Someone landing in again. He feels like he's going to the same spot. The only problem is you don't have a lot of armor, man. I don't have any armor. Let's be a little bit safe before we fight.
I mean, okay. I don't know what happened there, but I guess we'll take it again. All right, I'm gonna get some armor here, and then I'm actually gonna fly away here. I do really like the portable radar, so I'm actually gonna uh, buy one of those. Just so we can get us a bit more intel wherever I fly to. Okay, what's the play here? Let's see. Hey, right, so far so good, man. What are we on? 10? Pacing wise, I don't know what's a good pacing to set yet, but we'll get used to it. Ah, oh, shit. Someone right there. annoying because I didn't even get a chance to use my armor plate that I just put down. I didn't get I didn't know I had no armor chat. That's just like me being stupid and not getting armor to be honest. If I get armor there that's a completely different gunfight man. Completely different. All good though, all good though. Ah, do I land back on him? He wasn't great, to be honest. Like, he should have fried me, but he didn't. Like, when, I, when he got me in that little trap, he should have fried me. But, yeah, he didn't. So, oh, I feel confident to reach out him up there. All right, more armor now. Yeah, that was such a winnable fight. I just trolled so bad. It's all good, man. When you're playing, like, Rebirth and then, like, rank play or multiplayer, it's, like, it's different pacing you've got to get used to. So, stuff like this is, is always going to happen. Right, there, there's the first guy. He's finding someone up there, so he looks like he's distracted. So I'm going to go behind him. Try to get as close as possible. No way. Oh. That guy literally flew at me thinking I was just going to let him push me. This guy did not expect that much aggression, bro. <laughs> he was not expecting that. Alright, fire start. Let's get the UAV going. I'm actually feeling very confident right now, chat, my gameplay, which is good. That's what I wanted. Alright, let's up the pacing a bit, man. Let's up the pacing. I feel like I can win my 1v1s. I just got to. Get more gunfights going. Right, he's right behind us, so we should have. Where's this guy, chat? There you go, man. We're frying. We're frying. How much money you had? Okay, you had a little bit of money on him, a little bit of cash. Fly let's keep going, let's keep going, let's keep flying, man. 14 kills right now. The resurgence is still active, chat. It's a good game right now. Definitely drop a, at least a 20 bomb. Another one down. Someone's actually on the buy right now, so we need to jump across. Fire sales over. Adjusting prices. No, wait, what? He fucking melted me. Bro, I need to see this. What? Wait, am I like tweaking or is that insanely fast? Wait, that was insane, right? Or is that just, is that just me? Am I like... I feel like that was a very, very fast kill. I gotta play my out for 20 seconds, man. Shit. No, oh, it doesn't really matter. No more resurgence now. I feel like when resurgence closes, I want at least like 20 kills. If I can get like a 20 kill before resurgence closes, then I'm chilling. Because then I can get like another like five. Five at the end. I feel like 25 is a really good game. But we'll see if we can hit 20 today, chat. Let's see if we can hit 20 for our first game. So, I can hear someone. I think he was on that level I was just at. Okay, so he's going to be behind me. So, we 
You're making me a bit weak here. So instead of pushing him that way, I'm just going to close the gap here. Yeah, so right there was just about... Just, it was a little bit, you know, um, just thinking for a second, right, where's he going to go to? Where's he going to push to instead of where is he right now? And I knew logically he had to go down there. And yeah, just, just kind of went into his aim there. Right, our goal is 20, 20 kills and a win there. Four more kills. See what we can do. You guys see we can get four more kills there? I, just, I don't play enough wars to know the Warzone cheese endgame. Like mid game, I can just run at people. Where end game, there's definitely Warzone cheese I need to know about. Should I fly at this guy? Probably not, right? I will do it then. Oh shit. Why did I do that? Nah, that guy got kind of finesse. I ain't gonna lie to you, boys. That guy got kind of finesse with the door there, bro. Right, 17 kills. Four enemies left there, so we need to basically kill everyone but one. For the 20 bomb. Oh, the zone's pulling towards me as well, man. Things I want these kills, though. But where is this kid? Did he jump away, chat? I wish we got this shit. He tried to bait me in one way. I just knew that if I committed, I'll be good. Wait, we might have made the play. Is he spawning again? He had a redeploy. I don't know what this kid had, bro. He had something. Oh, shit. Everyone's leaving me. Stim, what else has this guy got, bro? This guy looked like he had everything, man. Gas mask? Uh, I mean, okay. I guess I could use a gas mask in this scenario. Wait, what the fuck? What's going on? I've got a gas on my side, bro. We're chilling. You know what? 500 IQ play, chat. Let's run it. So I have a question. Where is this? Oh, it's 1v1. Now, where is this kid, bro? Is he, is he like... Oh, there he is. There you go, man. Hey. 19 kills. First game on. Not bad. Not bad at all. With a win as well, man. We'll take it. A little bit of a... Honestly, a pacing issue, man. I feel like if I get my pacing right, I can definitely get like, you know, 25, maybe 30 kills. First game, though, we'll take that for sure, man. YouTube, you guys know the drill, man. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you guys are new. That is our first Warzone solo win. 7K damage, not bad. Not bad at all, man. Again, we can up the pacing and just keep on doing what we were doing. Just at a higher level, we'll definitely be able to drop a 25 to 30 kill game, man. We'll take it. That was a, that was a lot of fun, bro. <laughs> Did you guys enjoy that? You guys like that shit? Hey, that was lit, bro. Let's take that. Check. Give me some bumps, man. First fucking game, first win. Was that our first game or am I trolling? Am I, trolling? I, th I think it was our first game, right? I think it was. <laughs> Why is my thing, like, frozen? I won't let me leave. They just want me to, like, what? They just want me to see this victory. What's going on? My game's frozen. Okay. So you guys enjoy that shit? 
You missed the entire game? No way. Weasel, that'll be on my YouTube, bro. That'll be on my, uh, my Warzone YouTube. I got you. <laughs> no way. <laughs> that is so funny, bro. <laughs> Fred called Selim a fucking bitch when he went past him. <laughs> That is comedy. <clears throat> Alright, let's keep going, man. Let's keep going, chat. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Why has it put me in that chat? I want to run another rebirth. What the hell? I want one more resurgence game. One more resurgence game for the stream, then I'm off, man. One more resurgence game. Hey, NBK, man, thank you so much for the positive, kind comment. I really appreciate that and for the follow, man. Chat ships and love, man. I have just wanted to stop by and say thank you for your guides and coaching video. They help a lot. Hey, I really appreciate that, man. I'm glad they help you. And uh, yeah, man, that's what I do them for, bro. I do them to share the knowledge that I've gained from, from other people, from playing, from the amount of time I've played and just overall my knowledge and everything. If I can share with people and help them improve, that's just, you know, it's just a great, a great feeling, man. So I'm really glad that it's, it's worked out for you, man. It, it makes me happy, man. Just keep going, bro. Chat, that wasn't a bad win though. I can't lie, like it wasn't a bad win. I feel like re it doesn't it doesn't feel like proper war, like uh, battle royale. It feels like multiplayer battle royale. But I just sneeze. But I like that. Like for me, I actually enjoyed that side of it. It's probably a lot more positive people like you, bro. Thanks again. Hey, thank you so much, man. I think. Call of Duty as a whole and esports and video games has a lot of. Enemies are dropping into the area. Watch the sky. It's that hay fever coming in, bro. <laughs> it's that hay fever. I think it has a lot of negative people, but it also has a lot of positive people. The problem is when you're in a field like this, or just generally. The negative voices are always just a lot louder, man. It's just the way it is, because positive voices don't really say anything, because, I mean, well, they're positive. They don't have anything to say, you know what I mean? Like, a positive person is going to go about their day, where a negative person is going to cause up drama and just cause up, cause up storm. Like, like there, was, there was a guy in the chat that just, just made a comment on the title, a really, really small comment, and it's just like, there's no need. Like... If it was constructive, I don't. I love constructive feedback. Like, I love people to say, "Yo, bro, like this is really good," but I feel this would be slightly better. Or for me personally, I don't like this. I'll be like, "Yo, thank you so much for the feedback. That means a lot, man." But just coming and hating without a solution, I feel like it just it just doesn't help anyone. You know what I mean? It just doesn't help anyone. I'm playing solo right now, Zach. Playing solo, bro. Hey, Jazz, you were close, man. You were close. You guessed 25, man. We finished on 18. Well, we're fairly close. Fairly close. <laughs> Fairly close, I, I should say. Alright, let's run it back, man. Let's, let's keep going. Let's keep running it. This kid is fucking fire, I can't lie. I don't know where anyone's at. This kid is fucking fire. Alright, we're back for some more solos on the island on Rebirth Island to see how many kills we can get in this one. Let's lock in. I feel like I'm going to go... Where am I going to go? You know what? Let's try the old strat. Let's try getting the heli. Let's try the old strat. The OG strat. Not that very good with the heli, but... I mean, that was very strange. That was really weird. Someone right there as well. Oh my god, there's like six people around me. There's like six people around me. Someone literally on my right as well, chat. Yeah, I was so weak there. I was so weak at that point, it was just trying to get away. 
Yeah, the heli, I don't know what I was trying, to be honest. I, in my head, it seemed like a good idea to get the heli, and then once I actually did it, I was like, yeah, now what? What's the, what's the next play? I will take the M4 for sure. I made him so one shot, I wanted to chase him. I didn't know he was there though. He almost killed me. What is that? What is even going on right now? Yeah, we need to get a high kill game. So last game we got a uh, 18 bomb win. Let's see if we can get a higher one this game. So the pacing has to be throughout the game chat. So right now, I need to up this pacing. So we're going to start with a bounty. To be honest, I'm just trying to see if I can get any weapon. Like, this doesn't look bad. If I can get my, my sub here, I feel like that would be very, very useful for us. This is what we're going to do. We're going to go through and get our sub. Okay, now we have the sub, right? We want to basically push the bounty. There you go. My teammate... I'm uh, not my teammate, but someone takes out the bounty. So I'm actually going to get my other gun as well. We don't have enough money for a UAV, so we're going to get a portable radar. I feel that like portable radars are very, very strong. I mean, let's go through, man. Let's just get out of here. So there's a bounty... Use a heli again just to kind of get out of there. Right. The bounties give us more cash flow. So when we get that kill with the bounty, we can just get those UOVs flowing in. So there should be at least two people here in front of us. There's one. Paul Moreno goes down straight away. There's a second. Right, so where is he? He was here. It looks like... I accidentally pressed my um, button on my scarf that switch controllers. I would have been fine there. I think I would have got that kill. That's what be man. Accidentally pressing the button on my scarf there. Gotta be very careful. This guy's landing in. Before he gets a weapon, take him out. There you go. I can hear someone else around me, so. He might do the same thing that I did. He kind of just get very aggressive there. So this guy landing in, man. I feel like there might be a free kill here. Problem is, I don't have any plates to work with, so. There you go. You can see the way I was chasing people right now, trying to get... So right there, what you want to do in that situation is use your sound cues, okay? I realized that he wasn't moving, so my first thought was, right, I need to slide into cover. So I slid into cover, and then I camered him, and then from there was a very easy kill. Does the ebook still apply to Modern Warfare 3? I would say it does, but I'm, I need to make a new updated version. I think most of the principles will apply, but there's certain, like, mechanics and stuff that might not be as kind of, um, you know, as well as if I made another version. But I will make another version for sure. Oh, where's this guy? Where's this guy? Where's this guy, chat? Oh, shit. No, almost fried him, bro. <laughs> Is a blam blam blueprint not usable in multiplayer with a new update? Uh, I'm not sure, to be honest, bro. I've not, I've not tested it. I've not seen anyone else mention it, so... That's the first time someone's actually mentioned it. Um, obviously, it was working before, so there's a chance they took it out because it was kind of broken. There is a chance. But yeah, I'm not really sure on that, my friend. Oh, my God. I need to win that. I need to win that. Yeah, that's insane. Yeah, yeah, I'm not sure if it's banned in, in rank play, man. Is, a, is a, that variant banned in ranked or no? It wasn't last season, but it could could be this season. It was broken. I need a bit more cash here. We're not having a good game, chat. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Compared to the first game, this one's a little bit slow, which is fine. It happens. It does happen. I reckon we can up the pace. We can still get something going there. That guy, was, that guy was beaming me, bro. There's no way he had a normal normal gun. I bet you had Lodi. Yeah, I, I can just tell. The way he was shooting me, that like he had a Lodi weapon. So I got very fortunate I killed him there. 
No, my God, where's he coming from, man? What's going on, Craze? I actually, uh, I changed my FV now. It's actually 105 on multiplayer. And rank, and rank, uh, Warzone's 120. On multiplayer, it's actually 105, and Warzone's 120 still. How long have you been playing COD for? Uh, so I'm 23 right now. I've been playing since I was about 10, 10, 11. Playing for a minute, bro. Playing for a minute. Yeah, that game was a bit choked. All good, though. All right, stream. I think I'm going to end it there, man. We've got a lot of content to, to get through, man. Got a lot of editing to do. We we got some bangers today. Chat, how'd you guys find the stream? You guys enjoy it? Did you guys enjoy the stream? I'll potentially be live again tomorrow in the day. Um, I'm not going to be live every single day just because I, I am trying to focus on my YouTube and just building my three channels and stuff because it's quite a lot of work. Um, but I'm, I'm always happy to be live and get the gameplay on stream and stuff. Um, yeah, man, we'll just see how it goes. But thank you. I appreciate you guys, man. Appreciate you guys tuning in again. My, li my live channel, I have just linked it once again. Chat, we're incredibly close to a thousand, man. If we can get a thousand subs, and that would be insane, man. Be very, very insane. And uh, yeah, man, everything's looking well. I really, really, I've been enjoying the stream. Really been appreciating the support. Thank you guys so much, man. You guys have been killing it. You guys have been killing it. So yeah, nothing more to say. Just thank you guys so much. I really appreciate the support. Um, you guys are the best. We're growing and growing and growing. It's it's becoming like. My dreams are coming reality, man. We're, we're growing daily. We're kind of getting closer and closer to the goal I want. And yeah, man, well, we're going to be an optic one day, chat. That's the goal. Be an optic creator. And uh, it started off as like a, a dream when I was younger, but now I actually see it as a reality, man, which is crazy to me. Um, so yeah, thank you guys so much, man. I really appreciate the support. And I'll catch you guys for another stream potentially tomorrow. If not, I'll catch you guys in the YouTube videos, man. Peace.